afternoon, folks. It's Brian Paragini, a senior trader and co-founder of ProfessionalStockTrader.com, and I'm bringing this closing comments here about 20 minutes prior to the market close. Right now, we're down 167 points, and it really doesn't matter whether we close down 150, 125, or we close down 250. Point being is nobody should be surprised that we're getting hit the way we are. We are overbought. We've got earnings seasons. Alcoa is coming out with earnings after the close. Of course, I don't know what they are because I'm, I'm, I'm taping this here about 20 minutes prior to the close. But what I do really want to talk about is a couple of things. We talked about yesterday on the mid-morning commentary that we wanted to potentially be a buyer of gold stocks if they opened lower. They never opened lower. They opened higher. And they kind of backed and filled and danced around all day. We talked about it. It looked like those stocks were bottoming out and ready to turn up. So we weren't afforded the opportunity. Gold also, we thought, would turn it's up $11 here right now. So, you know, we're patient. We're going to let stocks and trades come to us. As I always say, patience, discipline, and using stops. Well, we were patient. We identified win resorts yesterday that it was absolutely ludicrous that UBS went from a hold to a buy on the stock. The stock had more than doubled off its bottom. It was up more than 50%, um, you know, in the last three days prior to yesterday. It went from 20 to 30. UBS comes out yesterday, being Monday, with an upgrade. The stock spikes. We short into that spike. We came on mid-morning, told you about it. Stock is trading in the low 32s. Now it's $5 off those highs, trading at $26.91, down $4.29 of this as of, the, of this recording. It's not by chance that the stock is just down. We read the charts. We look at the technicals. We use a little common sense here. If you're looking to learn how to put these kind of trades on yourself and you're looking to make money on a consistent basis, um, go to our website, take advantage of our three-day free trial. I can't say anything more than that. Please fill out the information accurately on the subscribe form. That's all we do request. Uh, every day we talk in our daily live webcast about, you know, technical analysis, the economy, answer whatever questions our members might have. And I think you'd really enjoy it. So go to our site and take advantage of the three-day free trial. I don't really have a whole lot to add here today other than uh, a couple stocks I think of note that look real interesting on the charts that I'm looking at. Humana up a dollar seventy-three trading at eight twenty-eight oh uh, twenty-eight oh four. Um, that looks real nice on the charts. It looks like it can head even higher than it is right now. It's just breaking out. Uh, United Healthcare up a dollar sixty-six trading at twenty-three fifty-nine. Looks real nice. It could be moving. It is moving into some area of resistance on the charts with some moving averages. You know where we're at right now and a dollar above it. It looks like it's breaking out on good volume. Same with Humana. It looks like it's breaking out on good volume. Another stock that does look interesting on the charts is Tabba Pharmaceutical. It's down thirty-four cents on the day. Um, it's going to trade some rather light volume here relative to what it's done here over the past you know several months so this also looks like a stock that's getting ready to push back to the upside a lot of moving averages coming in in that 44 zone mid upper 43s to 44 and change so I think this is a stock that looks real interesting I'm not going to tell you to go out and run out and buy them because that's not what I do I like to just share ideas with you but those stocks look real interesting on the charts even if the market drops, I think these stocks I've just mentioned can perform. I think eventually at some point the Obama administration in regards to the Human and United Health, uh, the health care stocks, I think they're gonna they're gonna soften their stance on that. And I think the health healthcare stocks are gonna have a real nice play this year. So I don't have anything really else to add other than have yourselves a great evening. Those of you that followed us on the Wind Resource trade, you gotta be dancing in the streets because it was one heck of a trade. Have yourselves a good evening, and we look forward to more of you becoming uh, members and trial members. Have a great night.